Hello. Yeah, I'm back. We're going to do about it. Anyway, I this is something that I hinted at doing a couple of days ago on one of the other vids where I found something rather interesting on a costuming channel and decided I just had to do it. I mean, yeah, you just gotta sometimes. The costumer, Rachel Makes It, was using something called a random aesthetic generator. It mixed up all manner of ideas into literally random aesthetics, some of which I have never heard of. Now, some of them that come up are kind of tacky, but some of them are a lot of fun. So I decided to take one of the ones that I I didn't really create, but generate it and see what I could do to create the pieces for such an aesthetic. In this case, it's the glam armor. Yep, glam armor. Now, all I could think of when I saw the glam armor is somebody who's like making bank, farming like high expense organics or something. And her and all the rest of the, the high organic types are at a buyer's convention and trying to make sure that all their stock gets bought up and everything. But they're all meeting together at the, the Organic Growers Club for lunch. We'll get there. Lunch. Now, I've got my, uh, <clears throat> what, standard farmers and others would could, would call a wife beater which I think is rude but it's basic tank top okay the pants I have on are buff colored khaki Gloria Vanderbilt jeans in style of man Okay, now, part of the outfit is my little chapeau with a little wheat sheath going on here and artistically distressed so that it looks like I've actually been out working in the field a lot. Now, for this luncheon, now, I've worn this one once already. I have this lovely patchwork shirt that I'm going to put over all of this. And it's got sleeves that can be properly rolled up to the elbow. So, yeah. I've also got these wonderful new work boots that I picked up. In suede taffy. Yeah, taffy. It's got a fancy logo over here. And, you know, they ain't even worn in yet. But suede I mean, if you're wearing a, a nice tawny colored khaki pant, you really need 
a taffy boot to go with it. Let's not forget our daytime pearls and just a little bit, just a little bit of diamond. Now, for the evening, I mean, you're going to get rid of the hat. I mean, you're going to get rid of the hat. You really are. You get rid of the hat. I haven't really done much of anything with the hair today. But you get rid of the hat. And, you know, it's evening. I'm going to use something a little more flash. I'll just do my little rose up here to keep any strays from running away. Now, you get rid of your daytime purse. And I haven't pulled out necklaces and stuff for all the evening wear. I mean, because it depends. It depends on where you're going. It depends on what the occasion is. However, I have a pair of the Gloria Vanderbilt jeans, style Amanda, which is really, really good hair shapes and apples. They're wonderful. Absolutely delightful. But the Vanderbilts I'm talking about this time are solid black. Okay? Solid black. I mean, we're talking evening now. And I've got the proper combo here to take this whole thing into the evening with an over shirt with textured sleeves and if I still want to do the roll up there's a button here and one of the interior tabs but it's it's all beautifully textured. The back has got one of those little pull-in places so it gives you a little waist tuck in the back and the tank is glittery. It says evening all over. Now of course with the black jeans and the black shirt you need to have black boots. Now these black boots are slightly distressed and they've got a little bit of urban flash. It's not flashy, it's just flash. So you've got this nicely distressed little bit of urban going on. You know, you can add or subtract whatever depending on what kind of evening it is, you can get really, really out of this world with the, with jewelry. I would take, now I used the CC, C color unisex three, which is inspired by the J Star androgyny. Going to shift from this shape, which definitely, definitely day work, darkening this up just a tad, smudging some black in here instead of the gray. The liquid lipstick that I've got on is a physician's formula. Excuse me. And it's a matte. And it's one of the velvet finish ones. And it's called Retrospective. Now, names like that. 
Now, what I'm going to do is I've also got some of the LA Colors shiny lip gloss. I'm going to fancy this velvet up. Just like that. And like I said, darken this up just a little bit. Bring it up a little, bring it down a little bit with black instead of gray that I've got in the corners. And I'll be ready to boot scoop all night wherever we're going. So yeah, armor glam. I've got a list of random aesthetics that I'm going to be going through. Tell me what you think. You ready to go lunching with the organics? ready to deal with the fires for your crops, ready to go fascinate a few people at a big farmer's grange meeting. Clam farmer. Just wait till you see some of the rest of them. Wear your mask. Keep your distance. Get your vaccine. Stay out of trouble. There is no bail money. If you start the trouble, there is no bail money. Be good.